everybody. Um, it's December 5th, 6th, I don't know, oh god, sorry. Um, and we're getting our first really big blizzard. I mean, look at the size of these flakes, it's crazy. And I haven't recorded the chickens in a while, so I decided, um, it's not right in the morning, because I've already let them out and stuff like that, but they're in again, because obvious, obvious reasons it's snowing. Oh my god, it's all climbing all over me, ah! <laughs> um, but I wanted to record the, uh, the chickens, how big they are, because I, I haven't, I just, I, I've been so busy, guys, I haven't had a chance to. Oh, who's that? Is that, uh, it's hard to see with the light. That's either autumn or that's speckles. Oh, there's, there's Sparrow. Hi, Sparrow. And Sparrow and Marilyn have been laying eggs. I think, um, I'll put this up here. I think that Flower might be laying eggs as well, but she doesn't have the colored eggs. And I think that's the only reason why is because she's not 100% Aracana. I mean, she looks like she's, hi, honey, look how big they are. Okay, so that was Autumn up there. Okay, so that's Autumn up there. And, um, Speckles, where's Raven? Huh, there's a little flower over there. And here's Sparrow. Who is such a love? She she gets actually gets jealous at night when I hug the the ch I, I take them and I, I hug my chickens at night. Um, oh no, sorry, that's Beckles. That's Raven up there with her. I think. Yeah, I don't know. I'll figure out one of these days. Oh no, wait. Oh, <gasps> Marilyn's laying on the nest. Kind of want Justin to do something about making that. A tighter seal. We've been filling the um, boxes though with plenty of shavings and stuff, so it's pretty toasty in here. Um, and you know we have the heat lamp as well, which is is on this. My beautiful Sunny, he's such a beautiful. Sorry, he's such a handsome rooster. Um, but no, Sparrow, she gets she gets so jealous if she is not the last chicken to be patted at night. It is so funny. Her eyes actually close and stuff. It's so cute. But I have some stuff I wanted to. I have some bread and corn I wanted to throw to throw to them. Of course, they might not go out, um, but we'll see. Let me just let me just pick this up. There's my little girl. Hi, baby. Hi, little Marilyn. Okay, there's no eggies yet. Not today, anyways. Well, no, actually, there's pretty eggs this morning. No, there weren't any eggs this morning. It's usually we get one one to two a day right now, and that's only because the only three girls that are possibly laying or have laid are the first batch, which is, you know, Marilyn, um, Sparrow. She's a good layer. Hi, aren't you, girl? And um, Flower. So, yeah. But I just wanted to throw them some, some bread. Hi, Marilyn. Hello. Oh, you wanted to come out? You're not laying on the nest anymore? Hi, baby. Oh, you're just so adorable. Take a picture of these girls. They look so similar now with their, their the pattern on their neck are the same. But Marilyn, I think that's as big as she's going to get. Because she um, is part silky, which I struggled with remembering on one of the, the past videos. <laughs> Struggled, but there's the three older girls, and there's Sunny. <laughs> it's like, what's up? What are we? What are we doing? What? Want some bread? Oh yeah. Oh, <gasps> Marilyn. <laughs> this is my bread. <laughs> oh, Sparrow. Look, 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 look. Um. So yeah, it's been it's been something else. Oh, and oh. Okay, I'm gonna take the whole thing. All right, <laughs> a little fluffy butt. <laughs> um, my car uh, just broke down last night, which was great. I was on my way to getting my son from work, and um, the oil light went on, and then the battery light went on, and I started to slowly uh, decelerate, and wasn't able to put my brakes or anything. So that was fun. <laughs> but I mean, everything everything worked out. We we have AAA, so my husband and my my parents. <laughs> Oh, there's my sunny crowing. Um, 
we were able to, you know, my, my parents were able to, to come over, um, cause they, they live only 19 minutes away from me. They were able to come over to the house and, and stay with the kids cause they were sleeping. And, um, so that way, once they got there, my husband could leave and get me and we got the, the AAA tow came and got the car and followed us home. So, you know, um, it just sucks because my van's been out of commission since August. Um, and now my car is out of commission, but the silver lining is my husband gets, he gets laid off every year. And so he just got laid off a few days ago, <laughs> which it's like my car just, my car held out till, till then. So now it's, it's not like I'm stuck because, you know, I homeschool my kids. If I needed to go anywhere, you know, my husband could take me because I am so deathly afraid of, of driving the, um, the truck just, just because guys, I just, I can't. <laughs> I just can't. I thought I was going to have a hard time with... Oh, hold on, Flower. Here, girl. I thought I was going to have a hard time with... um You, girl. <laughs> Here, girl. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. Um, I thought I was going to have a hard time driving the van, you know, from, from when I, I used to have... I used to have a Sonata. And, I mean, it's not a big car, obviously. But then after that, I was like, I don't know if I can drive a bigger vehicle. But I did, and I, I love my van, so I don't know. I'm thinking of maybe um, seeing if I can get a, a loan myself, because my credit's good, and, um, you know, getting a, a new van, because I, I, I could use it. I mean, obviously, i got four kids and, and stuff, and a whole menagerie here. You drinking the water from the uh, snow droplets? You want some more bread? Hmm? Sunny, you want some bread? Sunny. <laughs> yep. <laughs> he's, he's a good rooster. He really is. I'm glad. I mean, he's just so magnificent. He's a good boy. Okay, Marilyn. Okay, I know. Oh, up, oh, up. Oh, flower got it. <laughs> Come on, Raven. Come on. Uh oh, I hear. Um. Oh God, I already hear amb ambulance and stuff like that in the distance because it probably because of the snow and. Oh Lord, I I hope and pray that whoever, whoever's going on, they're okay. It's like, oh my god, my parents are out in this right now. They had a, they had to go to Tractor Supply. Of course, my dad's got a truck, so and he's a good driver. Um, but uh, they had to get some food for their animals. Oh my goodness. Okay, 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 <laughs> okay. Oh my word. Can I, can I take some pictures of you? I haven't been able to take. Um, pictures of my, my chickies here. Huh, it's just been so crazy. Hi, flower. Oh, you don't, no, don't jump on me. You got muddy feet. Yes, you do. Huh, I love these birds. I really do. I just love them. Here, want this? Oh, yeah, that's a big piece of bread. Oh, it's a big piece of bread. But, yeah, um, I found out from somebody at Walmart a couple weeks ago. They mentioned, you know, because I was getting... See, I love, if you guys know who Jordan Page is, I absolutely love her YouTube channel. She actually, she changed my um, financial lifestyle, I guess you could say. And um, she introduced, you know, the whole fact that you can freeze things like bread. You can make, pre-make peanut butter and jelly sandwiches and freeze them or pretty much anything. You could you could do lasagna, what you know, whatever. You know, you can just, you can look it up or whatever. Um, and anyways, oh. That was a quick one. But anyways, I go to, like, Walmart, you know, because I have a big family, and I like to, you know, I, I'm not going to just throw money out the window. Um, and I do apologize, guys. <laughs> this isn't just going to be about chickens. This is this is going to be about stuff that I kind of just want to chit-chat about, you know? That's okay. Um, I figure, why not? If you're not interested, you don't have to keep watching. But, you know, if you are interested, then cool. You'll know, hang out and stuff. Um, or, you know, you can get some little, little money saving tips and whatever. But anyways, um, it has to do with, with bread. She's like, oh yeah, I, I go in the clearance section and get the bread because you can just put it in the freezer, which is so true. And so, you know, they, they have, they, I mean, they have daily loaves of bread that like Italian or French bread that are a dollar anyways, which, you know, is, is cheap enough, you know, but then they, they put them on discount saying, oh, they have to be sold by today, like 65 cents. I'm like, heck yeah, I'm going to get like four loaves of those. I'm just getting some corn here. Um, and so I was buying them in the cashier. She told me that the Salvation Army in town 
does a every Friday um, from 9 to 12 you can go there and you like you don't have to you know you don't have to be on like whatever food stamps or anything like that you can just go and they have tons of like food that you know is just they're, they're giving away or whatever and so anyways I went there and I was like oh, I'll check it out and I told the lady I have a family of six you know and I said well my husband's unemployed right now because he just went on it and um, so she gave me this huge box of food like all good food guys um, cereal um, macaroni and cheese juice boxes apple like little individual apple sauces chicken organic chicken broths um, what else tomatoes um, corn <laughs> isn't throwing corn this is this is old corn but um, cans of corn tuna like albacore tuna tuna fish tomato sauce, you know, pasta sauce, stuff like that, um, peanut butter, and then the bread, guys, like, no joke, they, they get, they get donations from stores that, you know, this, this bread could be, it could be expired by, like, one or two days or whatever, which is, like, guys, there's nothing on it, it's fine, okay, you know how many preservatives are in stinking bread, you know, um, but anyways, she was like, oh yeah, you can take, you take whatever you want, so I got, like, I got, five loaves of whole wheat or whatever or not even whole wheat bread. I don't know it was like potato one one thing was like potato bread one was like wheat bread but anyways it was like just bread that like you know my kids would use anyways and then I got a, a big loaf of Hawaiian um bread my teenager absolutely loves he ate the whole loaf already <laughs> and I also got like uh they had some little pies they had hot dog rolls, hamburger rolls. So anyways, I got, I got a, a seeded, um, hamburger rolls, which my younger two, my two younger boys, they ended up just eating, um, up today. And also I got some other kind of loaf or whatever. something. but anyways, I put like a lot of some of it in the freezer, but the other ones I had made, um, 38 peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Like I pre-made them and, and wrapped them individually and froze them. <laughs> And yeah, so that's and now now I'm gonna be making French toast. Um with a lot of the other stuff that I have in my freezer, which again, don't knock it guys until you try it. I mean, just the fact that there I mean there was so much bread that the lady, you know, she there she says, you know, I just can't stand seeing food go to waste. She says, Oh, don't worry, this food will not go to waste. And it's true. So if you guys, you know, if, if you have a big family and say I know right now times are tough with, with you know, corona and all this stuff. If you have a hard time getting food or whatever, or if you feel like you could just use a little extra, there are places like that. I know in Massachusetts there's, you know, Salvation Army. I'm pretty sure Salvation Army is like all over the place. But I mean, just check it out, guys. You know, don't, don't, you know, whatever, stick your nose up to it or something like that because I'm not ashamed. But anyways, I'm done with my rant. Um, I guess I just needed to get that out. <laughs> I wanted to show you my beautiful chickens, but look how big they are. Look at look how big Raven is now. Like, oh my goodness, she's getting so big. They're all getting so big. I just love them. Oh, Sonny, what was that? He's like, you startled me. <laughs> but um, I hope you guys have a fantastic day. I hope you guys are are safe and well. And um, you know, just if it's snowing like this where where you are, just just be careful out there, you know, and uh, stay warm. But I hope you guys have a blessed day, and I'll see you in my next video. All right, guys. Bye.